Hello everyone, Brandon here with a sneak peek of our latest mesocycle. So, what we offer at Strict Vision Athletics is not just in-person training. We actually offer a Vimeo channel where we have pre-recorded all of our training. That's my training, the mesocycles that periodically intensify month by month, depending on whatever goal it is you're trying to reach. Our Vimeo channel is where all of that is stored, saved, and available for your viewing pleasure. Now, what I'm offering here is a sneak peek. This is actually a core day from Mesocycle 9. It's outstanding. Right now, if you guys go check out uh, the link in the description below, it's located on our Vimeo channel. Hello everyone, Brandon with Strict Vision Athletics here with Mesocycle 9. This is a core day for Mesocycle 9 composed of five exercises. So five exercises, the first two are single sets done by themselves and then the last three are actually done as a triple set. So this workout really shouldn't be all that invasive, shouldn't really be that long. You should be able to clock the whole thing right around 45, 50 minutes. So let's get started. The first exercise, first exercise as you can see right here are farmer walks. Now farmer walks can be done with a variety of different things. What I have are the farmer walk handles by Sorenex. Those are what I have found to be the best for these. Uh, you can get those at Sorenex.com. Your gym will most likely not have these. I, they'll have some variation of this most likely, but if they don't, you can always use the dumbbell. Find yourself a 20 yard space, 20 to 40. You essentially want to go 40 yards on the right, 40 yards on the left. So if it's 20 yard distance that you're dealing with, go there and back, so on and so forth. The second exercise, hanging leg raises. So this is one of my personal favorites. Hanging leg raises can be done from any squat rack, from any uh, area where you can anchor the straps and then hang. That's where you can do your hanging leg raises. Make sure when you do this that you don't allow yourself to sag into the straps. You want to engage the lats, have a nice straight posture, and make sure you keep that throughout the whole movement. You're going to raise your knees up, attempting to touch the elbows, but that's a little bit advanced. If you can't do that, just try to get up to 90, then come down slowly. Next, we have our three exercise triple set. You've got your hollow rocks, your crab toe touchers, and your twisted mountain climbers. So this is all done on the mat, you guys. That's what's crazy good about this little triple set here. There's not a lot of movement that's needed. You don't have to go from station to station to station. It's all right there on the mat. First one are hollow rocks. So hollow rocks, that's a, an exercise that I actually tried recently. I, I hadn't done a lot of these in my past, but I really like them. What you're essentially doing is keeping your core tight, generating just enough momentum to where your body is gonna sorta hinge back and forth like a teeter-totter. Make sure you keep your back rounded and your core tight. You don't wanna be doing a sit-up movement with your back. Everything is frozen. The only thing that's moving is your body, just hinging back and forth as you see in this video. Next we have the crab toe touchers. So these are really good. And this is done, uh, as you can see when you, when you witness the actual movement, why they're called that. You're in uh, basically a crab walk position, hands and feet. You're gonna reach your right hand to your left toe, back to the ground, left hand, right toe, back to the ground. And you're gonna do that alternating, left to right, and then right to left is all one rep. So you're gonna do that, and then your triple set, your final set of this triple set, is your twisted mountain climbers. So twisted mountain climbers are exceptionally fast. They are done uh, almost aerobically. You are in a plank on your hands and your feet. Your knee comes up this time to meet your elbow. So instead of the crab walks where your hands reach up to touch your toe, in this case, your knee is gonna reach forward to touch your elbow, and you're gonna do that in a very repetitive, very fluid motion left and right and left and right. You're gonna to wanna to kick this up and you're gonna to wanna to do this for a, a high number of repetitions, sometimes even 30 or 40 reps. Uh, that's what I'll say for this, for this exercise uh, and really for the triple set in general. I would take, honestly, I would take 20 reps for all three of these. 20 reps hollow, 20 rep crabs, and then 20 rep mountain climbers. For the first two, leave it up to you guys. As I mentioned, the distance for the farmer walks and then just for the hanging raises, eight to 10. That's a decent enough number. I hope you guys have fun though. That's an awesome workout. Thank you guys so much for checking that out. If you guys are interested in subscribing to our Vimeo channel, you can check it out. It's in the link of the description below. Thank you for watching.